hey y'all welcome back to my channel so to, for today's video i'm going to be reviewing this wig by ali bonnie hair um this is the package that it came in it also comes with this little thank you card as well as like um how long the hair is the measurements and everything i also love that a lot of hair vendors um, or companies are including these elastic bands especially depending on what style you're going for um, so that you can get the extra security when you're gluing down your wig it also came with some nail stickers which i'm like in love with because i'm of course doing nails now um it also came with a hair clip as well as these ranky danky eyelashes um so this is the hair um it is 12 inches quote unquote um, and this is how it looks, of course, straight out of the pack. Um, comes wrapped up in everything. And this is a wavy type textured hair. I think I want to say it's a loose wave textured hair. So this is a 4x4 lace closure wig. So when I show you here in a bit, like how much space it is, that is all the space it has um, as far as lace and how you can manipulate that little parting space. This hair also comes with your standard two combs on both sides by the ear, um, one in the back, as well as, um, you know, this little, I thought about saying the front, but ain't nothing on the front, um, just the little lace uh, part. So that's how much space you get. Um, and right here I'm showing you um, that the lace is pretty brown, so it's kind of close to my skin tone, um, but I am going to go in and bleach it and this is where the lace stops so um you see nothing but track from here on out of the wig like i said it is a four by four so um that's about standard so obviously the hair is not plucked yet but i just wanted to try to show you guys how much parting space you would have and where the track starts I love letting you guys see how the wig looks straight out of the pack and onto your head um, just to give you a visual of how it actually comes um, before any manipulation. And as you guys can see, it is kind of thin. Where I fluff out, that's more so like where I would like more hair to be. But I feel like this unit is definitely great for the summertime because you don't want a lot of hair on your head. Um, and I'm just going in and reiterating the parting space for whatever reason. But yeah, that's how much you get, get from the front and the back. Um, and of course, you can do a little side part if you would like. And yeah, so after that, um, all you really get is track and the cap, which is kind of constructed not so great but um you know it'll do you see what i'm like the little flab right there that's just i guess cap and um the tracks connected to the cap so i went ahead and bleached the knots off camera as well as went ahead and did some of the wine curling um so i was going for a scissor inspired look which i've done before and i really love that look on me so uh, for this hair i wanted to try to achieve that again so i'm going to be uh, taking my wine curler and um, just little sections of the hair and i'm going to be curling the hair um and that's going to be shown throughout the rest of uh, these clips and then towards the end I will be coming back to give you guys my overall thoughts and opinions on this hair.
y'all so y'all pretty much saw the whole process um i did bleach the knots on this hair um and i went ahead and curled it as y'all saw in the video and for this part like the bangs i was trying to go for like the scissor inspired look that i've done before but as you can see i didn't wasn't really able to achieve it because this hair is pretty thin um, it is on the thinner side and that's something that I do not like. Um, I like thick, full hair. So I was a little disappointed in that, but um, this is what I was able to achieve. I did some wand curls. Um, I used my straightener just to flip the bangs up like this. And um, I did like a little swoop right here. Um, I tried to achieve it on the side too where there is like lace, uh, but I'm really, you know, very underwhelmed by this hair. Um, so yeah, I mean, I really don't have much else to say. Uh, thank you, Ali Bonnie, for sending this hair to me. Um, but it is not the best hair. I'm sure y'all have better hair on you guys' site. Um, so if we, if y'all want to reach out again and we could do a collaboration, that'd be great. But this one did, just did not work out for me personally. Um, but yeah, if you have this hair, I will link it actually down below. And if you have it, then let me know what your take on it was. Like, did you like the hair? Um, but yeah, that's the end of this video. If you liked it, make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video.